In other news, Queensland students enjoyed the break during the school holidays. Alisa Ventura reports from Australia. Around this time of the year, students here in Queensland, Australia, has concluded their second term of schooling with a two-week school break. However, due to current COVID-19 restrictions implemented, their school holiday plans might be changed in more ways than one. As of 12 noon of June 1, 2020, the Queensland government has proceeded with the Stage 2 easing of restrictions. To name a few, these current restrictions are unlimited travelling in overnight states anywhere within the Queensland state borders, gatherings of up to 20 people for events with compliance to social distancing and reopening of business such as restaurants, cafes, beauty salons, gyms and more, public health measures, such as social distancing of 1.5 meters, hand hygiene and staying at home when not feeling well are still ongoing, ensuring the community's health and safety. Nonetheless, students and their families might be subjected to alter their holiday plans to accommodate and comply to the current restrictions. Furthermore, due to the Stage 2 easing of restrictions, businesses have reopened, allowing more employees, especially parents, to return to their jobs. With the ongoing school term holidays, majority of students are at home for the weeks to pass. Parents of students will have to accommodate the situation to maintain balance in their work and home life. The emergence of the COVID-19 pandemic has created a great impact within the society. The restrictions implemented to keep the community safe has influenced the way Queenslanders will spend their school holidays. On the 3rd of July 2020 at 12 o'clock in the afternoon, the Queensland government will be easing the current restrictions just in time for the final week before the next semester of the school year starts within the state. From Townsville, Queensland, Australia, Alyssa Ventura, Eagle News, we live in interesting times.